This is how we compost our wood chips. This pile of chips is aged for one year. Chips are all cedar. This pad is around 12 to 18 inches deep. After the pad is leveled, we apply sulfur on top, add a layer of hay, top with six inches of finished compost. Then we apply gypsum on top and inoculate our seeds with bacteria and fungal showing. We sow clover, alfalfa, rye, and our old seeds from the garden. Cover with grass clippings and water in. Try to hold moisture around 50% through spring, summer, and fall. Here is one of our test tubes showing. 8 inches of cedar chips, aged 6 months. 2 inches of compost with perlite, so we can see the compost the chip line. Inoculated 4 seeds, 2 beets, and one spinach and one rye in this test tube. Started October of 2024, had two mushrooms in January this year. 65% of all chips broke down to an eighth inch screen. The remainder 35% was 100% inoculated from observations under the microscope. We will start to harvest the pad in October we will run it through an extractor to get all the microbes and fungal growth. 75% of the extract will go on pastures, lawns, and it's best applied right before it gets too cold to spray and before a rain or snow. The remaining is used to inoculate our compost mineral pellets, which is called FNW compost pellets for gardens. Most of the inoculated bacteria are nitrogen fixing bacteria. Our extract tea is combined with biochar that has been ground to 20 micron. Carpal hydrates is added to the tea, which turns it to a black tea and is a food source plus protection for your microbes from the environment. Then we add a fish and crab concentrate that is a good source of fatty acids and a food source for your fungal and bacteria. This mixture is an excellent dethatcher for lawns and crop residue. It's best applied before a rain or snow. You want to try and get it to penetrate down to about two inches. We have had excellent results on existing pastures and or seeding anew. We spray with a 50 micron on fields. If tilling in anew, it's best to find the depth of your hard pan. Spray before plowing, spray before or at seeding, and then row in. Contact us if you have any questions or help getting started. One pound equals 50 gallons of extract. Thanks for watching and happy growing.